Hi, Nicole. Hi. How are you? I'm okay. Okay. I'm sorry you're not feeling that well. I'm going to first verify your date of birth. Is that okay? It's going to be April 21st, okay. 2004. Perfect. And can you please verify your last name as well? Smith. Okay. Go ahead and tell me what's going on with you today. Um, so I've been having some really bad pain, like right here under the arm. And mm -hmm. I guess this side of my arm in general has been not feeling well, I guess. I fell a couple days ago on my bike, but um, I didn't think much of it, just scraped my knees. Um, but ever since, my arms just felt really tingly and weird. Okay. Did you lose consciousness when you fell? I don't think so. Okay. Not that I was there, though. Okay. Any pain in the back? I have a little bit of pain on like my left shoulder. On a scale of zero to ten, how would you rate that pain? Like six. Have you been taking any medicine to help with that? Just like ibuprofen. Okay. And any facial facial pain? Um, I don't know if this counts, but like right here, I guess that's where my face meets my neck. Okay. I've been having it on the same side as my shoulder, just like right there. And it started right after the accident? Yeah. Okay. Are you taking any medications on a daily basis? Um, I take Adderall and I take birth control. Okay. Any surgeries? Um, no. No surgeries. Okay, I'm going to put some gloves on. And are you experiencing um, any shooting pain down the spine? Um, I would say down on the higher part of my spine, probably down from my neck. Any flu-like symptoms right after the accident? No. Okay, this is going to go sublingual under the tongue. I'm going to have you hold it for me, okay? Go ahead and lift the tongue up a little bit. Good. And now close. And can you hold it for me? This will go on your index finger. Okay. Okay, just a little bit longer probably. I'm going to slide this up. Blood pressure is 98 over 65. Systolic is a little bit low. Okay. 
Okay. Heart rate is 59, oxygenation 97%. Do you feel dizzy at all? A little, yeah. Did you drink anything hot when you came in? I had some tea this morning. I'm going to go ahead and just palpate your neck and your face. I'm going to move the hair in the back. Go ahead and shrug your shoulders and keep them shocked for me. Just keep them like this. Okay, you can relax. I'm going to palpate your arms. So I'm looking for any bruising. And you mentioned that you scraped your knees as well. I forgot to ask you, were you wearing a helmet? Um, not really, no. Okay, no worries. Yeah, my mom was really mad at me about that. And your neck in the back here. Okay. Can you go ahead and look straight at my nose? Pupils are kind of dilated and a little bit uneven. Okay. Ahead and look right here for me. And look here. Okay. Can you give me a big smile? Alright. And frown. Puff your cheeks. Keep them puffed. Don't let me unbuff them. Okay. No worries. Alright. Now I'm going to go ahead and close one there. Can you breathe in, breathe out through your nose? Okay, same thing on the other side. Okay. Alright, I'm going to check inside of your mouth. Go ahead and give me a big ah. Uh. Uh -huh. oh, okay. Uh -huh. Here we lose the midline. Can you go ahead and try to push this uh, wooden spatula with your tongue? Go ahead and open and now push the spatula. Good. And on the other side. Okay. Good. Okay, I'm going to have you cover one eye. And with the other hand, can you please hold this snail and chart? And I'm going to have you extend your arm all the way. Perfect. So I have here two colors. I'm going to need you to tell me which color is to the left side. Red. And what color do you see here? Green. 
All right. Now, is there... Can you read this last row? Not really. Okay, I know you're not wearing contacts. Do you have a prescription for glasses? I do, but I don't wear them that often. Okay. Can you try and read this last row? I... T E B H. Okay. Can you tell me what number you see right here? Six. Okay. What about here? Five. Okay. And which circle is bigger? This one or this one? The first one. Okay. Go ahead and switch eyes. Okay. Extend the arm all the way. Can you go ahead and read the same row starting with the letter to the right? H P F T L. Okay, and what color do you see here? Red. And here? Green. What number do you see here? Nine. What number do you see here? Three. Okay, which circle is smaller? Eight or nine? Eight. Okay, perfect. Okay. Now, can you try and read these numbers right here? So, without trying to, like, you know, make your eyes like this, this is how you're trying to focalize, which I understand. So, 37. Okay. 28. Okay. 34. Okay. 62. Okay. 48. Okay. 26. Okay. 5. Okay. 52. Okay. Have you noticed any changes with your smell? Smell? A little bit. I haven't been able to smell much. And that's mostly from the accident, um, or even before? It happened actually before. Okay. Go ahead and try to taste this for me, and tell me what it tastes like for you. Peppermint. Okay. What about this one? That doesn't taste like anything. Oh. It tastes sweet. Like fruit. It's better. Okay. So there were some that you kind of got them wrong, and you're right. Your taste is a little bit off. I do have some smells as well that I would definitely want to check here. Okay, I'm going to have you close your eyes and I'll give you a few pretty strong smells, I would say, and I'm going to have you identify them, okay? like bitter, like oniony kind of smell. Okay. I don't really smell anything. Okay.
like a light lemon scent maybe. Okay. Like flowery kind of. Okay. You can go ahead and open your eyes. And yeah, the smell, definitely there is some olfactory damage there. Which makes me think that you might have hit your head and even lost consciousness when you did and you did not realize. Um, it might have been just for like 10 seconds that it happened. Mm, okay. What I'm going to have you do now is I'll have you lay down and I'll start with the scalp and move down the body to see exactly where we can pinpoint the nerve damage. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and just find a hairline here. I'm going to touch you with two textures. Go ahead and tell me if this feels sharp or dull. Dull. Sharp. Dull. Dull. Sharp. Sharp. No. Does this feel cold or warm? Cold. 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 Does that feel cold in all three parts the same? It was colder at the end. Does this feel cold or warm? Cold. 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 Does this feel sharp? Mm hmm. And does this feel sharp all the way? Yeah. Does this feel sharp or dull? Sharp. And now? Yeah. And now? Mm-hmm. Does this feel sharp? Yeah. Does this feel sharp all the way? Yes. Does this feel colder? Warm. And now? Warm. And now. Cold. Okay. Just gently palpating to see exactly if there is any swollen can you go ahead and take a deep breath in and exhale 
Okay, one more time. Breathe in and breathe out. And again, take a deep breath in, breathe out. And again, breathe in, breathe out. Again. And again. No punctured lungs. Okay, please tell me when you don't feel this vibration anymore. It's still. Okay. It's still. message. Can you please tell me if you feel this on the left or right? The right? Left? In the middle? In the right? In the middle? On the right? On the left, down the middle, and can you tell me which one you feel, sharp or dull? Dull. 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 It's a little sharp. Dull. 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 Sharp. Dull. Sharp. Sharp. Dull. 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 Sharp. Dull. Dull. Sharp. Sharp. Dull. Sharp. I'm going to be drawing two shapes, one on the right side, the other one on the left side. I'm going to need you to tell me what shape you can identify, okay? Okay. Okay, what does that feel like? Like a star. Okay. Yeah, no. Um, I don't, maybe a square. Okay. Can you tell me what letter I'm drawing? T? C. F. G. 
she? B. Q. I'm going to touch it with two textures. One is going to feel dry, the other one is going to be wet. So I need you to tell me which one it feels. Wet. Dry. Wet. Now go ahead and tell me if you feel two or one pressure point. One. 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 Two. Two. One. One. Simple percussion here before any fluid build up. Okay. Okay, Nicole. Unfortunately, there are some inconsistencies and I'm a little bit worried about your spine. Um, I forgot to ask you if you've been experiencing any headaches. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I am afraid that you are at risk of some mild seizures and we do want to send you to the hospital. So as soon as you can, I'm going to have you go to the area uh, where we can take our patients to the hospital just to have them checked. I want to make sure that everything is okay before you go home. Okay. We're going to run some tests and um, see how, what the results are from the CT. And are you allergic to anything? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're going to run a CT with contrast just to make sure. It's going to be of the head, neck, and um, upper and torso. Okay. Is there anything uh, that you are concerned of right now? Do you have any questions for me? Um, no, I'm okay. Okay. Uh, would you like me to call any family members for you? Could you call my mom for me, please? Yeah, absolutely. We can do that. Thank you. You're welcome. So I will see you soon. Don't okay. go anywhere. Thank okay. you.